Hey, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake that liquor. Hey, shake that liquor. Hey, shake it, shake it, shake it. All right, we got it. All right, first things first, we have to make a drink before we get started. Best friends, first of all, I know y'all probably think like, hold on, wait a minute. I thought you said if it's brown, pour it down. Well, you know what? If it's light, today is gonna be all right. It's hot as hell outside, so we got to have us a refreshing light drink. Now, I don't always do light, but sometimes you need to have your little light drink here and there. I don't know what I'm about to make. We just gonna call this uh, Best Friend Delicious. That's what we're going to call it. I got a little mint that I already rinsed off. I'm going to put some of that in there. Best friend, that's a mojito. Shut up. I don't know what it is. I'm about to make it. Okay? We're going to see what it tastes like when I'm done. So we got a little mint. Go ahead and muddle this up. And you know mint. <laughs> Best friend, I don't get it. They say it's mint. I swear that smell like some stinking ass field. <laughs> some field weeds. That's what that smell like to me. Cause when I think of mint, I think of a peppermint. You know, double mint. I don't, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know what that is, best friends, but I did forget my juice, so let me grab some good old lemonade, simply. Simply, oh shit. <laughs> Just like that, quiet. Grab that simply lemonade. Shaker, got my ice in there. And because I, drink, I like to drink dark, we're gonna put some light, but we're gonna, be heavy on the hand. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> All right, we got that Simply Lemonade. Oh, I think this is gonna be good. Best friend, I fucked up. I forgot the sugar in the rim. So we gonna hope, we gonna see, I'ma hope and pray this mint stay down in here. Stay. Boom. Bam, just like that. All you gotta do is talk to your food. Talk to your shit and listen to you. When you had that kind of relationship, that's how you know you. You drink too damn much. When you got that kind of relationship with your drink, you know what? It's gonna be a good day, best friend. It's gonna be a good drink. I might go back to white. I don't know, sometimes it make you fight. But we're gonna take a little strawberries. Now these strawberries, I cut them up yesterday because I know I wanted to do this with you and put some sugar on top, put it in the refrigerator. And we got all that good deliciousness, all that good juice. So I'm gonna take some of the juice, put it down on the bottom, muddle it with this mint a little more. Boom, boom, boom. We in there, we in there, baby. And then take some of them strawberries, drop them at the bottom. Now, it's time to finish it off. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, 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 shake that liquor, hey, shake that liquor, hey, shake it, shake it, shake it. All right, we got it. Oh, that's strong. I, I smelled that taking the top off. We gonna pour that on in there. You should have called me. Why you never called me? Why you never called me? Look at, look at that drink right there. I'm gonna stir that up a little bit. You know I gotta try this, best friends. Bitch! That's good. Let's get ready to start cooking. I got my drink. Baby, this is a good drink. I don't know what to drink this. I can't do plants in my liquor. I don't do plant. That's why. Okay. Let's let's start cooking. Best friends, I'm ready to eat. So let's get ready to cook. We making this good old chili. I already got my chicken breast that's chopped up and I already cleaned it off. We'll go ahead and put it in the pot. 
Remember, my pot is a nonstick pot. If you use a nonstick pot, use wood. Don't use metal because you're going to scrape the shit off. And that's all bad for your health. But we're going to go ahead. Ugh, I don't want to touch this, but I'm going to touch it anyway. I'm going to put it out in here. I got a little olive oil in here. Bam. And this is two pounds of meat. I'm doing two pounds because I'm going to eat this for the week. And I probably, I know y'all probably thinking like, um, best friend. It's hot as hell outside and you making chili hell yeah. Turn the air on and it'll be cold as hell inside. Don't come with me with that. I eat what I want to eat when I want to eat it. I don't care if it's summer, winter, fall. I'm going to eat it. So, ugh, I hate the way the chicken feel. Drive my hands off here. Turn this up a little bit. And my friends, these meals are quick. This probably would take us a good hour to make. Only reason I say that is because I let it simmer for like 20 minutes. It's probably gonna take me like 15, 20 to cook this. So, we'll let that simmer a little bit, let that cook up, and we can come back and I'll show you what it looks like, and we'll get this chili started. All right, best friends, I'm gonna season my meat, my chicken, while it's in the pot, I got my secret weapon. It's called a uh, secret weapon. <laughs> you, everybody got their own secret weapon. I can't tell you what this is, but I crumpled it up. My Aunt Tracy will beat my ass if I tell you what this is. But uh, other than that, I'm gonna put this in the pot. Bam, it's in there. Nature season, of course, you know I love my nature season. So I'm gonna go ahead and shake it up. I got a lot of seasoning I'm gonna put in here, but it's gonna be real light because we got the chili powder packet shit that we're gonna put in there that's gonna flavor it up a little bit. And if it need any more, we'll do it later. Remember, less is best. You can always add. Larry, just a little bit, I'm gonna go across. Because I'm doing chicken. Kicking chicken. Love this stuff. It's so good. It's not that salty. And then also do my garlic powder. I love garlic. Now garlic ain't salty. You can put however much you want in there. I'm gonna put a lot because I love it. I love it so much that I'm gonna put some minced garlic in there. I'm gonna do one. Two, three, that's it. <laughs> do it how you want to do it. I don't care what you got to say about how I did mine. This is how I'm going to do it. And I'm going to shake a little pepper off in there. And we good to go. Make sure you mix it around real good. You don't want that seasoning just sitting there in one area. Oh, and watch the splashes. And no splash. Now, best friends, I'm gonna let this cook a little bit before I start chopping it down a little. Cause um, I think these chunks is a little bit too big. I'll uh, chop it down with your spoon. Don't get a metal spoon. Get your your uh, your wooden spoon and chop it down if you use a nonstick pan. Other than that. Ooh, it look good. Next, put your onions in there. We ready. We ready. Like Tiffany has. But we ready. We ready to eat. I'm hungry as hell. Shit. Bam. Put your chopped bell peppers in there. And y'all remember when I made that chili? Um, I mean, not that chili. That, them tacos, and I put bell peppers and onions in my taco meat, but it was in ground chicken. You can also make chicken tacos like this. Make sure you chop the uh, chicken up real small and use your taco seasoning and everything, however you want to do it. Damn, you got chicken tacos. I try to just experiment with stuff. I get bored with eating stuff, like the same stuff all the time. So I just started making up stuff. 
we gonna have some videos where I make up some stuff. I might fuck up some shit too. But we gonna fuck it up together, laugh and drink and eat. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and let this cook a little more. We come back when it's all done. We're gonna add all our other good deliciousness in there. And we're gonna have us some chili. All right, best friends, we're back. The meat has cooked down. I chopped it up as small as I can. It don't need to be those big chunks, but I want you to look at, you see all that good juicy broth that come from all that, those seasons and all that deliciousness. I'm not gonna pour this off. This broth is good. That's why I like to use the uh, chicken breast when I make chicken chili instead of the, the ground chicken, but you can always use the ground chicken. But, however, now we have this cooked down and ready to go. Time to put in the chili seasoning. So I got hot and I got mild. So you ain't got hot, you got mild. What that make? Well, I guess medium. <laughs> I guess. Uh, don't ask me why I got hot and I got mild. Thought I got too hot. So I guess I'm gonna make medium today. So medium it is. <laughs> gonna add this in here. Damn, it's a lot of season. And the reason why I use two is because I got two pounds of meat. You're supposed to use the season for every pound of meat. I think that's everything, that's it. That's a lot of stuff. Go ahead and move that around, mix that around. See with this broth, I will probably won't need to use as much water. Um, we'll see. Yeah, I'm gonna need some water. I'm not gonna have to uh, use as much. Oh, look at it. It smells so good. It looks like a whole nother meal. You probably don't even know me. I'm getting ready to make some chili out of this. Turn that down a little bit. Now, I don't like a lot of beans. You're supposed to use, for every pound, you're supposed to use a can of beans. I don't like a lot of beans. I'm not got time for all of that. I'm not a beanie weenie ass motherfucker. So. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna use some chili beans, they kidney beans, and they got the mild chili sauce in it. Pour those in there. And then for my tomato sauce, I'm using Hunt's seasoned tomato sauce for chili. I got this at Walmart. I can't find it nowhere else. I always find it at Walmart. So Walmart usually don't have it. So when I see it, I stock up. I got like 12 of them in there. They're like a dollar and something. I don't know. Get them. They good. They better than, they got all the stuff in there that you need for chili. They better than just regular tomato sauce. So I'm gonna go ahead and pour this in here. Oh no. We want all that. Dang. So I'll mix this around. And look at there, we almost got some chili. However, we do need some water. Um, you can leave it like this cause, and you can have some thick hearty chili, but I recommend that you add a little water. I don't know how many people gonna be at your house, you can stretch it with some water. And I'm doing this because I'm gonna get all the good stuff from around the side of the can. Pour that in there and we also gonna do it with the chili bean can. Cause I want all, whatever is up in there, I want it. I'm using hot water because I want to speed up the process over here. Use a little first. Mix this around. Ooh, look at that, baby. I think that's enough water for me because I don't want it too soupy, but I don't want it too thick. I want it just right. I want a medium. You know what the seasons that we use? <laughs> medium. I want it medium. And uh, that's how you make the chili. I'm going to go ahead and let this simmer for like 10 to 15 minutes. They said 20. I'm going to do like 10 to 15 and I'm going to make my bowl of chili 
and I'm gonna show you my secret that I use. Some other people probably use it. I don't know if they do, if they don't. Uh, you can like, comment, subscribe, tell me what you think, or yeah, I use that too. But when we come back, I'm gonna have my bowl of chili ready with all my good toppings on it and my side shit. And we gonna eat before best friend and chill tonight. Love and hip hop. See y'all later. All right, best friends. It's been 20 minutes. I went ahead and let it simmer for 20 minutes. Go ahead and move it around. Look at all this good old delicious chili. I know y'all see all that. That's all that good shit. Now it's time to put it in the bowl. So, I like to eat my, I don't care for crackers. Um, I will eat crackers, but I fucking help it, I won't. So, I eat mine with spicy nacho and Doritos. <laughs> Best friend, my drink kicking in, so you know I'm silly. Shake, 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 shake. Shake that liquor, hey, shake that liquor, hey, shake it, shake it, shake it. All right, we got it. So I eat mine with spicy, spicy nacho Doritos, because before I had, with the tacos, I was using just the regular nacho Doritos and y'all was like, try spicy. I do like spicy, so I'm gonna go ahead. I listen to y'all, I was paying attention. I'm gonna go ahead and get me, scoop it on up here. Put me some in this bowl. Mm, 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 mm. All right, all right, all right. Got my chili. Now it's time for the cheese. I love cheese. I mean, like, I don't know. I can't do that vegan stuff. I can eat it. But right now, I can't. I just, I just can't. You see, I'm just, I cover, I'm covering it up, baby. Bam. After the cheese, turkey bacon. I don't eat pork since February. So I'm put some turkey bacon in here. On top, bam. You can do it however you want to do it. If you don't want no bacon on top of there, yours, don't put no bacon on top of it. I'm putting bacon on top of mine. And then we're gonna do a little dollop of Daisy. If I can get it to come out. Boom. And finish it off. To finish it off, put me some jalapenos on there. Put however many you want. Oh, wasting them. However many you want, but. And boom, get your spoon, get to the TV, get to the table where you can see the TV. I recommend you to eat at the table. Don't eat on, on your furniture unless you don't care about your furniture. I care about my shit. So, I'm going to go ahead and eat, clean up, and get ready for Best Friend and Chill because Love & Hip Hop is going to be lit tonight. <laughs>